I'm going to show you how to quickly create scrolling credits for your live stream in Keynote. So let's go. So here we are in a new presentation. We're going to click, drag, select all, delete. And while we're here, let's go to format, background, no fill, so we can have transparency. So now we're going to add a text box. And my text is already made, so let me paste mine in. And we don't need all of it for this presentation, so I'll just delete half of it. All right, make me a shorter list. So all you really have to do is create your text that you want to be in your scroll, format it for your screen to fit your video, right? A couple of things I want to let you know about is you want to pick a font, definitely that's sans serif, and you want a font that's going to have a medium or bold option because you're going to be scrolling over live video. You want to have your text legible and also you want to be able to use it at a size between 50 and 60 points once you have those things covered you are good to go you can add icons extra rows of text whatever you like just from the shape menu a logo you can bring in a graphic and i'm actually going to bring in my icon and let me size it down and i'm going to put it at the bottom of my text so let me scroll my text up now, one other thing that I did is I put a, several extra carriage returns under the end of my text, and I'll let you know why I did that in a second. So now we have that centered roughly on the text. Let's select everything, clicking and dragging across everything, and we're going to group it. So now all we have left to do is to actually animate it. So to animate, we're going to drag it off the top of the screen. We're going to drag everything off the top of the slide. Now, as you see here, you see the little clicker points for my guide box, right? For my text. That's going to help me align my text so it doesn't go off the edge of the screen to any of the sides, right? Because if I had the box and it lined up like this, I know some of my text is going to be off the screen the whole time that it scrolls. So that's why I put those extra carriage returns in so I can have an alignment box to know where my text is or what it's going to scroll through, right? So now that all my text and my icon are now off the screen, let's animate it. So it's selected. We're going to go to animate, build in, add an effect, move in. So we're going to take the bounce off. We're going to have it move from bottom to top. And I'm going to make it five seconds for now so you can see the animation. And there we go. You have just made scrolling credits just that quick. I typically make mine about 30 seconds to a minute, depending on the length of your text and how slow of a roll that you want. For demo purposes, I'm going to do it at about 10 seconds for our export. So file, export movie. Go to the next slide, zero. Go to the next build, zero. We're going to export as Apple ProRes 4444. Export. Okay, now let's look at it and see how it comes out. Okay, so here's our scrolling credits. Thank you all for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.